Hello, hello, all right, guys. This is my last two blasters that I have as of now. Um, maybe I go get a few more. I don't know. We'll see. I do have some hobby boxes coming. Uh, I always get my stuff like two weeks after the release date, so it's not coming this week. Well, my stuff won't be here this Monday, it'll probably be here the following Monday, I'm sure. So we'll see. Um, probably I don't know how many I have to look at the invoice, but maybe five or six hobbies regular hobbies and a couple jumbos but we'll see i don't know if i'm gonna open the jumbos maybe one i don't know all right guys uh let's get going I, my count is my total is uh so nine to ten blasters so eight blasters i've cracked open and i've done what four base two of the stars of the mlb and one like this i want the stars of the mlb chrome is in a chrome uh, you get like one of those in a blaster uh so i think my odds on getting that this sh that shouldn't be that rare of a card to be honest with you um i'd love to get you know of course a parallel of his rookie that would be like ideal like the best that would be freaking great man freaking great these should be at your local wallies uh mine restock 30 of these today and my store is a my local store the one closest to me is like a low volume you know what i mean it's like i asked the manager one day i said how come this store doesn't get like much of this or that or whatever and they're like because this store over here over on this street it was like this store over here did this much does this much you know what i mean volume this store over there does that much volume this store over here does that much. we do this and i was like ooh. It's like, but this store looks busy. It's like, yeah, but I, was, I thought about it. I was like, yeah, you don't have the traffic to go to other Walmarts. That's for sure. So that's why my mine kind of gets the lower stock on the end stick. Stick. If so, if my other the other local stores that are really populated, I mean, they're like they probably got a lot. Of, they probably got a lot of this stuff. They, I want to say they. Well, if we got thirty, maybe everybody got two cases or something like that. I don't know. Albeck, I definitely wouldn't overpay, guys. It's going to be this is Top's flagship. It's going to be everywhere. Target should have it in store. They probably, I went there to Target first this morning. Um, and another burger, a few of his. And they didn't have, they didn't have it. They didn't have any. Well, actually, no, they did have like some other like Chronicles and stuff like that, basketball and. But they didn't have any of this. They probably did later in the day. Three rookie cards out of that box, out of that pack. And maybe one out of this one. Sometimes I'll do that, I'll do like three, one, three, one. Oh, we got a trout. I'm trying to find me a trout um, CSG 10, a card that I think is CSG, CSG tenable for a trout. Riley, Gill, Weaver, Rosario, Scherzer, Barnes, Alex Wells, and we got a Derek Jeter die cut. It's about one out of every other for these die cuts. Nice trout right there. How's it looking? Looks pretty good. Let's leave it. I'll look it over later with a fine tooth. I just need one. Just need one that I think it's the one one trout ten. That's all I want. Just one. One trout, not PSA ten. No offense to you PSA guys out there, but I don't hold too much stock in their tens. I just don't. <laughs> I've seen them. I've seen them. I'm sure other companies have them too, but I've seen them in slabs and I'm like, there's no way in hell that's a freaking 10. The guy that submits it must give them a lot of business and they hooked him up. That's the thing I know. Hell no. But it's like, there's no way in hell.
Eli, no Ernie Clements yet. Ain't that something? Let me get the wander here. Come on. I need the wander. Buxton. Come on, man. Twins. There's another one. There's a wander. Okay. There we go. Every time I've gotten one of those, I've gotten a base to go with it. Let's see. There's another one. I got a feeling these may end up being kind of cheap because what was there? 30 cards of these. 30 of these stars in MLB in the set. And you get one per pack. So that means it should be one out of every four blasters. Which is about right because I've got three of them. So. Give me that chrome one of those. I'll take that. That'd be nice. Thompson. Prayers. Weather. I say, boy, he's a beast. Freaking beast. What a horse that guy is. Matt Manning. Roberto Clemente. And Garrett Cole. Kyle Freeland. Joey Weddle. Lope. Jazz, Gray, Rookie. Uh-oh, here we go. Oh, nice. This is the uh, first number one I've had in a while, the 2022 Tampa Bay Rays. So that's not bad. First number one we've had in a while. It's not the Rook, but it's kind of close. Nice. Oh, nice right here. We got Jazz. And we got a Jose Ramirez with the stars of the MLB Chrome. Just one rook out of that pack, though. Hmm. So other than the Rays, who's kind of the chase team out of this? If you guys gotten any breaks down below? Who's who's running up? Who else is running up the price? The Red Sox, the White Sox, another Wander. Every time you get that stars in the MLB one, you get a base. Castro, Suzuki. Oh, there's a nice one. BC. Shane B. Boer. Then a Freddie Freeman.
Brian De La Cruz, the Marlins, Curiel, Brandon Marsh. There we go. Finally, is that the first one? I think it is. I don't remember seeing him. It's kind of unreal, though. Maybe that would be his first one. Well, I haven't had a Clement yet, so I don't know. Brian Hayes right there. There we go. See what I just pulled, right? And we're going to finally, I've been talking about it. We're talking about it. All these blasters I've been opening. I said, no Ernie, no Ernie, no Ernie. And we get it in a blue. The only one we pull, and we pull it in a blue. These are one, the blues are one out of every 10 packs. So freaking sweet. Now I can sleep tonight. Woohoo! It's the little things, guys. The little things. All right. Number 10. Here we go. Blasters, nineteen ninety nine a piece. That's two hundred bucks. Yeah, I got a, I got a mess over here. <laughs> got a lot of sleeping to do too, because I always sleep all my rookies and all the inserts. So, a lot of sleeping to do here, guys and gals. Uh, Strowman. Newt Bar, got a lot of him. Judge, Escobar, Pilar, Manuel Riviera. Not sure about that guy. Walsh, Brett Gardner, Glasno, Guerrero, Insert, and Javi Baez. Max Kepler, Luis Robert, Ustremski, Nelson Cruz. I don't know if he's coming back with the Buck with the Rays. Stay with the Bucks, Tampa. Ben Gamble, Cody Bellinger, Yadier Molina. One rook there. Here's the medallion. I haven't got the Wander medallion yet. I haven't got it yet. Looks like I got a bronze in here too. It goes to 2022. Flexen. Bergman. Or it could be that. The 35th anniversary one too. Suarez. Tom Murphy. Brendan Rogers. Dallas Chapman. Christian Pache. There's Terry Rookie, and who is it, it going to be? Uh, that, I thought that was going to be it, but that's not it. Who is it? Oh, it's Gary Cole again. I already had him. Ah, uh, wah, wah, wah. Oh, Gavin Sheets, though. Nice. I like these ones. Those are tough. Joey Gallo on the back. So Gavin Sheets. Nice one there. Take it. Let me go ahead and sleep that one. Because I got a feeling that's kind of a tough pull. Those are tough pulls. Parallels are limited in this. It's not Panini. You know I mean? They're not throwing... It's not even update, for Christ's sake. They're not throwing a lot of parallels at you in this. Anything you can get parallels on a rookie. I was going to say, I thought that was another one. I was, no. See, I just keep seeing that raised symbol on there. Auto, Dunn, Archer, Soto, Jose, 
BB. There we go. That's what I wanted. What have I been saying? What have I been saying I wanted? There we go. I've been wanting this Wanderers Stars and MLB Chrome, and I finally got one. Nice. With four, three packs left, I got one. Now you get, there's 30 in a set. There's 30 of these in the set, the Stars and MLB. You get one Chrome per blaster, I believe. It's, it seems that way anyway, right? So, that means that card's possible. I don't know. Do the math. You do that math on that, let me know what it is. <laughs> not that rare, but like I said before, it's hot and they're not really throwing a lot of color acting on this. So the parallels are probably in the hobby box. Which I hope mine arrives soon. Otherwise, I'm going to keep busting retail until it gets here. <laughs> Gilbert, moving on. Rockies, Diamondbacks, Ricky Henderson, Aaron Judge. Jake Berger. A lot of Jake Berger, man. That's good. I like Jake. I got some of his Bowmans first. Thompson. Cap. Brian Anderson. Manoa. That photo's like definitely Stadium Club-esque. Helmick. Slam Diego. Got a blue. Who's the blue? Let's say if it was a one or blue, I'd freaking flip, man. Because that'd be a color match for the Rays. Zay Ramirez, the blues are one per 10 packs. That would be a definite hit. I'm going to have to go online and see if I can find a one on the blue. I wonder what they're going for. Even if everybody's chasing him right now, maybe I can find some, some good burgers. Good burger. Hey, wasn't that like a kid's show back in the day? Last pack, guys. Last pack. Last or 10, last pack. First Rook. Is that it? There we go. Willie Mays. That's it. And the Chris Bryant. All right, guys. I have like exhausted finally my whole Friday trip to Walmart and the 10 Blasters. Um,. Take a look. I've already started sleeping. Okay, no boy. Let's take a look real quick here at my wander count. At the end of the day, ten blasters. One. I probably won't upload all the videos. Maybe just this one since I'm doing like the real quick quick recap right here. The wander stars of MLB Chrome version. I kept saying it the whole time. This is the one I want. This is the one I want. Got one fine. Uh. This ain't a water, but it, he's on there, right? Um, I think that's him right there, right? Yeah. Uh, so, number two, 2022, number 142, 47. There it is, so nice one right there. Then we had another Stars MLB Wander. These are just the base ones. And another one. So we got three base, the chrome, Tampa team one. I don't see any variations, image variations there. And we got five base rookies for Wander. And this honestly may be my best one of him because this sucker looks mint, brother. I mean, look at the centering on that. Top to bottom, side to side. 
I got to believe this is it. This is this is the one. This is my keeper. I pulled it. It's mine. Uh, I think this is the one I'm going to get graded. And I'm going to get that. Uh, probably not. I don't know. Chrome cards are kind of. Uh, I don't know. Uh, this one definitely is going to be going off. This has got to be my best wonder card so far. I would believe it's a tough hit. 30th and 35th anniversary. Raise. I like it. And that and these borders. I've always found it on these type of cards. When they've been doing these. Like in, like in archives and stuff like that. I mean these borders on these are brutal half the time. It's tough. And this thing looks dang good. Alright guys. So that's it for now. We got what? 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. 11 Wander Franco cards. Out of 10 blasters. Um, other ones I liked was his cabin sheets. All right. Uh, my Ernie Clement on the blue. All right. I like that one as well. It was a nice hit as well. And, you know, a bunch of other stuff. But nothing really slamming other than those things. Uh, like I said, I watched uh, some jumbos. And some people are pulling these jumbos. And they got one wander out of it. They pay 220 for a jumbo. They get one wander and an auto of some guy that is, is going to sell for eight bucks online you know what i mean so it's like the jumbos are like high risk and can be high reward but it's a lot of risk on tops on tops flagship all that is and i just can't believe that the hobby boxes well i can't actually because you know franco that they're selling for that much money you're talking about 120 for a hobby that doesn't include, doesn't even guarantee one auto. I mean, I would wait on that. I mean, Stadium Club come out and all these other ones. We'll see what they're going to be priced at. But Stadium Club usually sells for about 120 with a guaranteed auto. Maybe two. Two, two guaranteed autos. So water is going to be out all year long. Um, I would do like this. I mean, I was thinking beforehand, I was like, the retail is the way to go. Because you get more cards, you're gonna get more wanders. Like I spend 200 bucks on 10 blasters. Look how many I got versus somebody who spent 15, 20 hours more than me and got one. And there's a lot of other guys in the set, and but unless you hit their great auto or some extraordinary one of one or of ten parallel, you're not really doing anything. So I would stick with the retail and you know let that hobby stuff go unless you can get it for a regular hobby. Like maybe a hundred bucks or less, or at the most. I mean, that's with tax. And the jumbos, I'd say for you know, one guaranteed auto, a couple patches, I wouldn't pay no more than one fifty for that. To be honest with you, I mean, max one sixty out the door. I mean, and that's even then, I might be like, hmm, I'd be looking at that Bowman draft. Maybe I just get another light box for twenty instead of buying that. You know what I mean? Honestly, I probably would. All right, guys, uh, that's it. Bye for now, guys. And uh, I am getting my hobby boxes in. If you wonder how much I pay for my hobby boxes, I'll let you know. I paid 60 bucks for each one of my hobby boxes. I ordered them on, uh, back in September through one of my distributors. And I think um, my jumbo cost 95, between 95 and 99 bucks for my jumbos. So, I mean, that's why I'll open what I did because I'm not paying that. And that's why I might not even open but one jumbo for myself. Because if I can sell it for 220, you know, you're doubling your money right off that. I, I open a jumbo, I sell a jumbo, I open a jumbo, I sell a jumbo. It's kind of a wash. You know what I mean? Because they're I think they're just way overpriced. But I do like those silver packs, so that kinda of always gets in my head. You know, and that's why I loved updates so much this year. Because that silver pack in there and all the color that they had in there. I still love updates. If they, them things come down to like 60 bucks, I still go get some more of the 2021 update series. All right, guys, that's it for now. Siri, that's it. Gone in out. Good luck finding this stuff this weekend. It's going to be out there. Just keep looking. All right, bye for now. Off to the next. Later.